Hey there friends, how's it going? So the last time I played The Sims, I had 100 children. You can see here I'm living with about 50 of them at the moment. So this is my orchestra of neglected babies, and I feel I have to be responsible here. I have to get a job to support all these babies, but that's not pretty fun. So I installed a chaos mod that randomizes nearly everything you do in the game. Oh wait, the power's been shut off. Okay, hold on. There we go, babies. We've power again. Now I can see the smiles on your faces. I think a detective with this mod will be hilarious. Let's go with that. What is this celebratory music for? What? She's now a rank 4 specialist with the resistance? Are you just imagining a different life for yourself because you're reading this book and you want to escape your real world? Can you all stop crying? It's Christmas. Just imagine the massive treasure haul we're gonna get when Santa arrives. Oh, he's dazed from space madness. Okay. <laughs> I was wondering what that was about. He's also incredibly happy for a new baby. I don't know which one, but one of them is giving him happiness. The hell is that? You got gnome. What does that mean? So I found a ring in Jim's bag. I think he's going to propose to me. I don't know what to do. What should I say? Yes, no, I am Jim. You are his girlfriend. I don't understand. You know what? Say yes. He's, he's not going to propose though. Wait, Jim just got engaged. What? <laughs> but he didn't propose. <laughs> she just insisted. I can't even find her in the relationship tab because I have 100 children. Oh, 99 children. That one just got taken away. And another one gone. And another one gone. Oh, another one bites the dust. Probably because he can't bite anything else, we don't feed them. Wait, who's burning to death? It said someone was burning to death for a second there. Oh, the nanny finally arrived. Okay, can you manage six babies? Surely you can. That's 94 less than what we started with. But look, they're all in the same place now, so you can take care of them. They're outdoor babies, so they like being outside. Sayori has learned how to make... <laughs> Jim Pickens is too hot for life. He is dying. Jim has been brought back to life. Okay, good. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> What is this? Are you having an epiphany? Are you deciding, oh, I should care for the children? Is that it? You know what? You have to replace some of these babies. Let's see here. MC pregnancy, pregnancy start. Pay off loan debt, loan balance zero, set amount zero. I, I'm not sure. Drop out of university. Who is it? You know what? Yeah, <laughs> I'm making decisions for everyone now. Oh, it was you. It was the nanny. Yeah, you got to drop out of university and care for your children now. The coconut rebate policy has been repealed. Oh, thank God. It's about time. Wait, what? Oh, God. God, someone's on fire. Oh, Jesus. Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh, Jim's actually saving her. I guess I need her around to save Jim, so that's probably a good idea. I don't even know what happened. It was, she was, like, drinking milk or something, and the milk caught fire. Damn flammable milk. Who must have bought the wrong one? Oh, Santa's here. Oh, Santa, did you bring me my one present? A shelter for the baby so they don't have to lie in the rain? I mean, I could bring them inside, but eh, we're not quite on that level of relationship yet. Oh, Agnes Crumplebottom passed away due to starvation, and the game is guilty me saying perhaps you're not ready for the responsibility i don't know who this lady is uh, now the she's on fire <laughs> i don't understand how because it was raining out here <laughs> santa's going nuts i just want to wait till work come on i'm going to speed up time and whatever happens in the next 12 hours happens what is this <laughs> select an agency you're giving me nothing to pick go away oh they're having babies yeah that's a great idea you have more babies <laughs> it came up that she won the magic duel and, re <laughs> and received for being a worthy opponent receive nothing just receive you know? Wait, what is this? The hen chick has gone into labor, apparently. What the hell? Why did it take me over here? What? Who is this? <laughs> Some sort of superhero? Supervillain? I don't know. There's a skeleton here. <laughs> what is happening? It popped up earlier that you died of starvation. Oh my god, everyone looks like a lunatic here. Instead of engaging the bullies, the chicken started some small talk with the bullies. It great. That's, that's great. Go on vacation with the skeleton? Mm, sure. Where are we going? <laughs> We went to the Star Wars colonies. Who even is this? Can I make the skeleton pregnant? That's a weird sentence. Pregnancy start. Okay, with this random dude. Yeah, three females. Okay, and you're in labor. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's nothing in there. <laughs> <laughs> Just celebrating childbirth, you know, it's a miracle really even more so than normal You cannot have a baby while on vacation. All right, let's go home then. Oh, the canteen is on fire Do they have firefighters in Star Wars? They're just still operating their business while the whole place is burning down I don't think I can leave the vacation until the fire stops. I'll call the fire department. Will that even work? Oh, no the skeleton Well, I guess they're not flammable. So it's probably best they put it out. Yeah, that makes sense bringing a whole new meaning to fire in the booth I called the 
the fire department, just my local fire department. They came all the way to space to put it out. I think they're just overwhelmed with what's going on, though. Okay, now they're putting it out. They can't put out the fire because it's not technically on the map, I don't think. Wait, oh no, that's not my skeleton. That's a different skeleton who has just died and is now a skeleton ghost. Okay, finally, I think we can go home. Yes, get out of here. Skeleton, you too. They're even walking with like a pregnant walk. All right, have baby at hospital. Yeah, join them. Wait, why did Jim just turn into this weird alien? What the hell is going on? Why? This guy's self. So is he still like Jim? Oh, he is still Jim. Okay, that's good. Wait, who shut down the power? The power has gone off in the hospital while my poor skeleton is going into labor. Oh. <laughs> What is this? Okay. Right, this one's called Spooky. This one's called Scary. It's like names from the Spice Girls now. And this one's called Skeletons. That's not a Spice Girls name. But together, they're Spooky Scary Skeletons. The babies are crying. I'm not surprised. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they, they do that a lot. Sorry about that. <laughs> all right, we're going home. I just want to go to work. That's all I want. Why the hell does Jim look like this now? What is he now? <laughs> what is going on with him? I think it's just a Shrek cosplay. Looks pretty good. No, baby's not allowed inside. Go outside, babies. Oh, the baby's on fire. I hate when that happens. The skeleton doesn't seem to care unless the skeleton is waiting till all the flesh is gone and they're a baby skeleton too. Like I thought it was going to be genetic, but apparently not. <laughs> Okay, it just kind of extinguished itself. That's handy. Oh my god, what happened? <laughs> she gained so much weight while I was gone. What is in that cereal? <laughs> oh, this is the skeleton. She turned back into a human somehow. Okay, works in four hours. Great, we just need to hold out for four hours. Oh no, what is this? Oh, I got a Madame Zoe. Great. Someone rang him asking, should she try for a baby? I mean, wrong person to call. Yes, try for that baby. I don't know how to go to work. It's time to work, but he's just standing there by the fire in his summer wear. He's got a moodlet missing my rodent. Is that what he calls his children that were taken away? <gasps> Finally, he's going to work. All right, let's do this. Jesus. I thought he was just going to skip it again. Yeah, that's right. You're a police officer now. Oh, no. <laughs> he hates it. <laughs> the hell is that? Okay, I don't know. If random stuff starts happening, everyone, it's not because it's my first day here. It's entirely coincidental. And I know as like police detectives, you might not believe in coincidences, but you better start. All right, we're going to a crime scene. Ooh. Ooh, nice set of armor. Uh, this is evidence. Not only is it huge, but it would be so big and clanky. Oh, that was close. The police just showed up. <laughs> My backup nearly caught me in the act, but I got it. Oh, I'm naked now. He's attempting a spin-off of the naked gun and he's taking it a bit too literally. Oh, I better take a picture of this evidence. There we go. This mirror might also be evidence, so I better get a picture of this as well. I don't even know what the crime is, but he's got his bat sense going here. The world's greatest detective. I guess if you do a lot of crime, you probably know what to look for. Okay, it looks like they were a dancer, because the footprints are so strangely. They were waltzing in here or something. <laughs> <laughs> He's just bending over taking pictures. Everyone's terrified of this oh, naked detective. <laughs> the pop-up is talking about a suspicious blurry photo. I guess that was the one in the mirror. Oh. Uh, the police officer's getting electrocuted. <laughs> Why am I so dirty? I keep getting these calls telling me about more children that he's had with these women. Uh -huh. <laughs> he's just singing away. Ooh, cool ship. This is also evidence. You know, I, I highly suspect it could be pirates. Oh, this is the person that got murdered. I guess. <laughs> I don't even know how they're turning into skeletons. Wait, where's the fire? Where is... Th there's another fire. Like, why is there a cheery tune playing? Where is the fire? Oh, it's in the cell. But sure, they're all on death row anyway. Well, if they weren't, they are now. <laughs> it's saying that work will end in an hour. I should wrap up what I'm doing, but I can't because the police station is on fire. Okay, we solved absolutely nothing. It said I did an adequate job, but all I did was collect loads of evidence and solved absolutely nothing. But don't worry, because we're going for a night on the town. You know, after we're done killing all the prisoners. I just, I have to wait till they burn themselves out. There we go. There goes one. The others might actually escape from this. Wait, how did the Grim Reaper die now? I looked away for two seconds and the Grim Reaper's dead. Wait, I said call the fire department. He ran in, sat down inside the cell that's now blocked by fire <laughs> and called the fire department. He always has to be the victim, doesn't he? Yeah, you gotta fight fire with fire, says Jim, which is why he's standing directly on the fire while putting out more fire. <laughs> 
Okay, the game just sent me to another lot. I don't know, was that part of the chaos mod or did it just get fed up with me never leaving work? But I couldn't because of the fire. All right, well, I'm home. I guess that fire will just burn itself out eventually. The hell is that? What the? I think I'm being haunted by like some salad or something or a stew maybe. I, I have no idea what's going on. Well, time for that night on the town. You know what? Let's go to a bar with the chaos mod on. What could go wrong? <laughs> What the hell is she screaming about? Oh, she's a fan? Oh, I thought she was terrified, which would be understandable. Look at the way he's walking. What is going on? He's so full of himself all of a sudden. She has fainted. He just sits down and nearly stands on her. That's what he thinks of his fans. Okay, what was that about? Why did it play that cheery tune? I'm just confused most of the time. Oh, we've got another skeleton. I like its hat. You'd never even notice it's a skeleton. Oh my god, this is why she's freaking out. He's a legit celebrity now. I don't think I've ever had that before. Yeah, okay, they're not that hyped about you. You can you can stop. Oh, you brought a wetsuit. That's smart. I should have brought my own one since I'm about to piss myself. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Oh, well, I don't think anyone noticed. He's very confident after pissing himself all over the floor. I guess that's what confidence gets you. Wait, he's possessed now. The mother calls and I must respond. What the hell? Ah, well, at least he's happy. That's all that matters, I suppose. And you know, I think it would be good to end on a high note like that. So we will end it there. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new here, consider subscribing. I'd love to have you around. Uh, leave a like or a comment if you've got a chance. I'd appreciate that. It helps me a lot. And uh, I hope to see you tomorrow. Bye for now.